It's weird as fuck. Listen, I've seen some weird Japanese commercials in my day. Being weirded out by sexy KFC is just baby stuff at this point. <gasps> I found him. Pant. Pant. Why am I running like this anyway? The new world. The new universe that our boss was talking about. It's making me giddy thinking about it. When we use this thing. You were eavesdropping. I was only talking to myself. You're persistent too. I'm pooped out from all the running. But I'm not going to battle you. Goodbye. What am I to do? I've gone and dropped my sweet key somewhere again. My hotel people won't be happy with me. I'm sure I had it when I left the reception counter earlier. If only I had the Paul Catch app dousing machine would help me find it. Oh no. I have one of those. Hold the phone. I'll find you. Don't fret. Miss! Hey guys, it's dark out! It just changed! We saw it in real time. Wow. Where the frig is it? Maybe it's in here. No, maybe it's inside that one. I have a question. What up, Vic? Chris probably had this question a lot and it's annoying, but is he playing the rest of the Wonky Dead? Yes. I just had it? I passed over it? Oh god. I'm stupid. Okay, hold on. Okay. The reception building. See, when you say that, is that this? Over here? Is this the reception building? I forget. No, that's not a reception building. Okay. Where was the reception building? Was it over here? <sighs> hey! Must be the money if you want to go and take a ride with me. Alright, cool. Thank you, guys. What am I to do? I've gone and dropped my sweet key somewhere again. Oh, that's my sweet key. You found it for me. Oh, that's sweet of you. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm coming inside. I hope that's okay. Thanks for helping me out. Here's something for your trouble. <gasps> nice. I don't know what this will do. But she gave me a flute. Its melody makes wild Pokemon more likely to appear. Wow. Nothing in your fridge. It's lined with Pokemon picture books. Empty. Like everything else. Alright, well I helped her out. I feel good about everything. I'm gonna go ahead and heal. Do I need to heal? I don't need to heal. I'm gonna go ahead and save. Have you ever looked into Prey? It's basically System Shock 3, but also kind of like Bioshock and by Discovered De uh, Dishonored Devs. The game is so fucking underrated. It is really good. I played it for a while. The only problem is... I was getting a little motion sickness. I don't know why. For some reason, that game was hecking me up. Oh no. You're still on my tail? The lake's within sight. You leave me no choice. My Pokemon will co you. Okay. But see, guys, there's no more graphical glitches. Like when they throw out the Poker Man, it just works. The music doesn't sound bad. It's nice. Don't block me. Wow. How'd you fix it? I, went, I looked up a, literally just on Google, guide to make uh, this meme run really good. And it was like a YouTube video. And <laughs> I just followed it, it was good. And then I looked up another one about uh, getting rid of some uh, artifacting issues. So I, I just used two or three YouTube videos and I fixed all my problems. YouTube videos are great, man. I can't battle anymore. 
I'm running on fumes. I'll have to give this to the commander. I wish I could use it at the lake. He's dead. Oh, Cynthia. Oh, hello. Long time no see. How is your Pokedex filling up? I came to research the folklore about the lake, but... Well, it doesn't appear as if the lake is open to the public now. Have you heard the folklore about it? They say there is an island inside the lake. And inside that island is a mirage of a poker man. No one must enter the chamber of that poker man. Oh, that's right. I had to talk to you about something else. Apparently, Cynthia's like the strongest, like, trainer or something. And, like, some lore I read. Is that right? Or am I mistaken? Hey, Lime. Where'd that Galactic Goof run off to? She's up there? She's the champ best champion. Okay. Huh? Is this your older sister? No? She isn't? Oh. Okay. She's the Elite Four champion. Okay. That explosion is in the Great Marsh? It wasn't anything serious. Mr. Wake told me to tell you that. But at Team Galactic, wow. Are they had a controller? What? Next time I see them, I'll teach them a lesson they won't forget. See you around. He's your friend? He's more impatient than he is energetic, isn't he? So, getting back to what I started saying earlier. Have you seen a group of Psyduck on... Yeah. Yeah, that's right. By the cafe on Route 10, uh, 210. You've seen that... Who is this? Bleed purple 1000 bonus 100 hey cry. Hey. I can't stay for much longer because I have class. But I've been loving the Pokemon lately and since it's my 21st birthday today I thought I'd say thanks with some bits. Have a fun stream. Happy yeah. birthday! Oh, hap happy birthday! Happy birthday! It's a it's good birthday, right? Yeah. Oh, good, excellent. Thank you very much, Roxanne. Enjoy your uh, 21ization. If you're gonna drink, drink responsibly. If you're not gonna drink responsibly, at least don't puke. Uh, Bofin, uh, Korautic. Uh, and a greasy pizza. Thank you. Oh, and dirty one. I just noticed this as well. Kind of broke till Friday, but I want to share the love. No matter how shitty of a day I'm having, your streams always make me feel better. Uh, have a wonderful evening. Also, I'm going to get Milky's tattoo. Uh, going to get Milky's tattoo. Thanks, Dad. Oh. Well. Have fun with Milker's tattoo on your body. It might be a mistake or a good decision. We're not sure yet, but I hope you have a good time with it. And Sinif, a uh, floof waifu, uh, Zivrin, says, Hey, Cry, I finally got a good uh, good paying job, so I thought I'd start a nice little streak to your channel. Uh, thanks for keeping me company on nights when things have been really bad. I mean, more than any, uh, one can ever believe. Well, thank you. It's very wholesome tonight. And Rex, uh, says tape all the DS's to your monitor. Absolutely. We don't use emulators. We just tape our DS. Uh, and Fern Club and Farstrid. Thank you, guys. Uh, you see the group of Sadak, uh, huddled with their heads in their, uh, hands? Anyway, uh, what you should do is use the medicine on the Sadak. You're working on a poker decks, so it might be worth your while. Thanks. I went on a big adventure with the poker decks when I was younger. I hope you get to meet every kind of porker man there is to see. It may help you with the secret of the Mirage Porker Man. See you later. Bye. Nice lady. Probably my favorite lady. Hello? The Pokemon of the lake won't come in if it senses people. We're lying in ambush for it here. Okay. Did Scott ever give you back your DS? Nah, not really. I've seen that before, Milky, and it makes me upset. Hey, what's up, Grovile? How you doing? I forget if Steel is even good against Grass. Crunch, I'm at like 5%, but I made actual good wholesome art of y'all and Cry want to see. 5%? Alright, if you're only at 5%, we need to wait until at least 10%. Listen, we can't blow, blow, blow it too fast, alright? That's just 5... Aw, oh, you jumped it! You jumped it! I'm walking. I'm looking at it anyway. Ah, it's cute. Ah, it's cute anyway. That's cute. Thank you. 
Oh, we also have to go to the left, too. There were still trainers we didn't fight over there. Oh, we're... I don't even know where we are right now. We're supposed to go back to that Route 210. We, we have a whole smorgasbord of things we gotta be doing, but we're not... We sure aren't doing it right now. Whooper, my boy. That is a girl whooper. Oh, and we're gonna catch that whooper, too. Come here, you beauty. I should have actually switched over to, uh... Wait, Whooper is a ground type, right? That eh, doesn't matter. It definitely fits me. Hey, what does that mean? When walking on land, it covers its body with a poisonous film that keeps its skin from dehydrating. Huh. Well, I mean, it only makes sense to me. Excellent. Gotta go see a group of my brethren side up cry. Darn tootin' I do's. I've seen that too, Milky. That thing's awesome. Alright, where was Route 210? Here it was. Alright. Had a slicing. Call a Burger King? Hmm. Would that have also been a good name? That's a good question. I sexually identify as a Psyduck? I mean, that's not bad, I guess. Probably not. Thanks, Greasy Pete. Brad's gonna be my 20th birthday soon. Wow, it's everybody's birthday around here. Uh, and I'm feeling lost and confused in life, but I'm glad to watch you uh, become Pokemon champion with chat. You know what, Greasy Pizza? I'm gonna give you a tidbit of information. It won't help at all, but it might if you pretend hard enough. Everyone is confused and lost as fuck in their 20s, so I definitely understand, and you just started it. So, at least you, everything's going according to plan, it's, I suppose. Oh, you better use this potion. Get out of here! Thank you, Andrew Doss. Anderson Doss. Hey, Chris, wanted to ask if you've recently seen a good TV show slash movie you'd like to recommend because I've emptied my watch list. I will after this hot dialogue. Oh, good. You used the secret potion I gave you. Psyduck are known to suffer from chronic headaches, just like Summer. But no one's been able to figure out what triggers the headaches. Oh, yes. Can I ask you a big favor? I want you to deliver this old charm to my grandma in Celestic Town. I know there are some rare poker men between here and Celestic Town, so... It'll be worth your while to go. Okay. My grandma has this sort of bossy atmosphere about her. I think you'll recognize her right away. Yeah, I'm sure you will. She's the elder of Celestic Town. And the location? Look in your town map. You can't miss it. Okay, I'm counting on you. See you again down the road. So essentially, she's saying, you want to know where it is? Fucking Google it. I like that attitude. Star me. Oh yeah, forehead, you're actually pretty high level. We should probably move you down. Chad, I'm so happy with our friggin' lineup. I've seen that as well, Milkster. I go to the Pokemon subreddit. So you're giving me all these reposts, my man. I haven't seen that one. That's a good, that's a good. That's all we're, that's all I'm gonna give you though because I have a lot of Pokemon to do. But you see that? That's a good boy. That's the card you put down when you wanna win the duels. Darn. Whoa, where did you come from? I am one of the ninja trio. Being discovered means I must battle. Okay, terrifying small child. Jesus. Whoa, cool bug.
No! Damn it, Bug Naruto! Thank you, Harlequin. Also, Rex, who says, tape all the DSs to your monitor. I think I already said that. Don't care. I'll fucking say it again because I make mistakes. That was one of them. Forgetting that I said that. And then re, -re, -re saying it. I, I have bad short-term memory. I don't know if anyone knows that. Now you do. Don't you detect anything at... What the fuck, Milky? Don't protect yourself! I've been aware of this for years. Free? I'm surprised you've been around as long as you have. You white girl wasted. What's to say, Ornus? God damn it, stop causing an uproar. That a boy. Girl. I don't know enough since like 2012. I know, and it's ridiculous. Prod on? Nice. Alright. To the skies. No, Milky, I haven't seen that. <sighs> hey, must cry. I can't remember how long it's been since I brought it to your channel on YouTube. It feels like it's quite a while. Man, I'm one of the- that's a lot of experience. I'm one of those people who's just been around so freaking long. Who... I don't know how the fuck I managed that. But it's pretty sweet, I gotta say. You getting burnt out on YouTube, dude? I mean, it's not that I was burnt out on YouTube. I was just burnt out on life. And I still needed to, you know, not... I still needed to be able to pay the bills, essentially. So, I mean, that's why I had... I was streaming, essentially, on emotional autopilot for a few months, it felt like, until I got my shit together mentally. Are you really just doing this to me, Cleffa? Really? All right. Been watching Christ since his first appearance on the TGS podcast. I remember that. That was a long time ago. Wake up, Queen! Darn it. I was watching an old video of you reading a Korean horror webcomic and I realized it came in 2011. I was gonna do another one of those Korean horror comic readings too. I found one. I just never ended up doing it yet. That was all just to beat up a small little Cleffa. Ay, ay, ay. That's okay. What? I don't know when I found your YouTube, uh, but I know I was. it was because my friend found your prairies and I really liked them. I got into your playthroughs. I remember those. I really liked doing that read stream we did. We should do another one of those sometime. I was gonna do uh, one of those the other week, but I ended up not doing it. But the reed streams are so cozy. Go to here, probably. I was introduced to you back when you first played the Pewts. How long ago was that? A long ass time ago, man. It played through. I remember the it played through. That was a really good game. Thanks, a global.
Catherine was my first playthrough. Follow the cat lady. Oh, dude. I gotta do... Uh, I've already forgotten the name of it. Just the new one. The new cat lady. I gotta get her done. But I still gotta do Walking Dead first. I think I might... We might see... Alright, so for those who don't know... Uh, I'm gonna be... For YouTube in the future... I'm gonna be doing two, two things with it. I'll be having my own videos that I personally upload 100%. And then I'm gonna be having videos that I have... Uh, guy that I'm gonna be paying to upload as well and when he submits them to me I'm gonna be watching them live on stream as like a previewing of the videos Because I need to watch them when he sends them to me anyway So we can watch them like before they would even go up essentially as like a YouTube or Twitch viewing party And if I have to make any edits uh, We can do a live edit as well. So it's perfect So it's essentially like a Twitch viewing party slash editing stream before it would go up on YouTube. The premiere, essentially, yeah. It's a really good idea, I think. So it would help us keep the... Keep the intimacy, I guess, if the weird, the, the strange term to use. The intimacy, I guess, of uh, editing because I've always done all my own editing for the, the whole time. So switching to an editor is a super weird thing for me. Like, I know I did it with Draxer for the near streams, but those were still streams. This would be non-streamed content, so it's a different thing altogether, you know? That ninja has a girl name. The randomizer also randomizes the names, which is amazing. <laughs> Remember subscribing to you because your Undertale playthrough made me cry? I was really lucky that yours was the first one I watched. It really got me immersed in the game. Somehow the Undertale playthrough caught the hell on like wildfire amongst the Undertaleian community. I don't know what the hell happened, but it was wild. Aw, oh, thanks, wow, look. And it's just because you pay respect to the actual game rather than talking over it. It's just there's a point when you should know when it's okay to talk over a game. Oh, this is sweet. Is this actually a water move? Oh, actual water move when we have no water attacks? This is amazing! What? All right, chat. I know we won't have paralyzed anymore, but I feel like this is what must be done here, right? Get rid of Thunder Wave, finally. Let's do it. Ah, oh, nice. Did I play Cry a Mad Father? I did play Mad Father. Yeah, when it comes to like, at least with my YouTube videos, I like to make it so you can still get the game experience. But the game experience, in the sense of you're playing the game, but you got this stupid white boy talking in your ear next to you as well but not like over the dialogue if that makes sense aqua tail because i want to see it nice you know a stupid white boy all right a stupid white man sorry better yeah you're right Nest ball. You're my stupid white boy? Aw, thanks. That's the sweetest thing anyone said to me all day. Oh, shoot, bud. I was always wishing you might give Angels of Death a try. Then again, there's just so much games out there to experience. We actually played Angels of Death a little bit on stream. For some reason, maybe it's just because I was playing it on stream in a group, but I just couldn't really get into it. Maybe if if it got me at a different time, like if it got me around the time when I was getting into Ib, I think that would have been good. But for me nowadays, it just didn't really grasp my straws of attention as much, I suppose. 
I miss you. I've been busy lately and I haven't been able to see a stream until today. First time in like a month. May I call you Daddy Otic if you want to, my boy. <laughs> Welcome back. Uh, when I found your videos of you and PewDiePie playing together and it was like the happiest day of my life, I didn't know you guys knew each other at the time, but I knew both of you already beforehand. My favorite game you played uh, was that 16-bit game about the girl uh, with the dad. That mad father is what you're talking about. Sorry, I can't remember the name. <laughs> yeah, it's all good, man. Thank you. Yeah, man. Uh, Feud's actually hit me up today for the first time in a while. Uh, he said, Thanks, bruv. Finally able to restore this account? LOL. So I'm guessing some he, he lost his Discord account at one point. So it's not like we hate each other, if anyone's worried about that. It's just we have lives. That don't involve me leeching off of him and grabbing his attention all the time to try to milk him for viewers and money. Uh, damn, is there a lot of people who do that? From the Dark Ages? Dude, that's so fun. You did that? Yeah, you did. Yeah, you fucking did. It's all good, brother. He also made so many memes. He has a lot of fucking memes. Remember the sweet Jibu days of Dandelion? I do. Dodger's so awesome, man. I want to do something with Dodger again soon. Not Dandelion, though. No offense, it's just I'm kind of done with Dandelion. But I'd like to do a song with Dodger again. Also, uh, Chicken Nuggies Yum. I'm sorry, Chicken Nuggies Yum. Uh, hey, baby, it's been eight months of me being too broke for me to pay for my education, but having just enough money to support you and my unhealthy obsession with chicken nuggets. Love you, bud, and keep being awesome. You know, if you saved those those bucks, you could buy even more chicken nuggets, just for the record. Think about that. But thank you very much. Also, happy meaning. It's not you, it's your emotes. I understand. We got some pretty sweet emotes now. You can blame Milky on that. Also, Sticks Knight. Milky and Angel. You both are great. Try saying not dinner line so quickly like he's a fucking lawyer. I mean, I gotta make sure people know. <laughs> I don't want to give them the wrong impression that we're gonna be doing dandelion. You burned me? Are you kidding me? I am not upset. I'm just furious. But then I wouldn't be able to watch you with no ads and those sweet, sweet emotes. Man, that's fair. I do like the no ad version. I mean, personally, I totally understand if you guys use ad blocker and stuff. Why, you know, keep a Larvitar? He's so cute. Oh, I did keep a Larvitar. That's what Rocky is. Rocky's Larvitar's evolution. Uber? Yeah, man, like, I've been saying you guys can freaking use ad block since day heckin' one, because I hate the concept of us doing some shit and just randomly an ad pops up in the middle of a hot meme and then you miss out on the, the, the joke when you see all the lulls spam by, but you see, you should buy uh, Nabisco for your milk some shit, you know? Like, I don't give a fuck about that. I don't want to see the meme. Thanks, Honest Banjo. That block doesn't work when I join the stream, but I don't get ads popping up after. I mean, at least there's that. I think there's, like, an integrated thing now or something. Like, it's straight up from the feed that they have the ad, or, I don't know, it's some weird Twitch thing. I could be wrong, but I think that's what I heard. Thanks, ladies and easy. Have you ever encountered fans 